Truck is XTV on air. We are now live in three, two, one. Welcome back to another Pokemon Scarlet, Vi Scarlet and Violet. It's Violet I'm playing it, but welcome back to another Pokemon Violet Wonderlock. The previous episode right now, we just made our way into our first adventure into actual Padea area. Somewhere in southern area. Today's right now, we're going to try to take on the gym leader. To the best of our ability, of course. If you're today's episode, make sure to like button and support the channel as our this is our current team right now. The Viv along we got it from the Wonder Tray. We lost our Gibble in the previous episode because why not? Why not? Um, we have entered a new area which is the gym right now. So we got two fire types in the back and a bug bug type that can use wind, or at least gust. So we have some type of co type coverage, but we're gonna try to do our best and see what we can do. Our Fue Coco should evolve anytime soon because it's almost close to level 16 because you know what? It's almost there. So why not? Why not? We're, we're stuck with three. We got a over level 100 Ar Articuno in the back just in cost of our red card emergency. So why not? Hey, kiddo. Would you like some refreshing ice cream? Uh, let's see. How much money does it cost? We got that much money. Egg power, ice power, raid power. Oh, what the heck? What the heck is this? What does that even mean? With LP? What? Oh, the LP's in the back. I'm gonna save my life? What is this? They couldn't give us like a good animation on that. Why is it so pixelated? You mungo power fire. What does it even mean? Ingredients. Chorizos. So we're just surrounded by all this stuff. What's the button to do the thing? That is not the map, damn it. We're already at 100. I'm gonna say. Rabu, get back over here. The gym is right here. This is entirely the, the gym, but the moment we walk out, this is entirely the area right here. What's this? The gym is right there. That's another Pokemon Center. Are we ready for this? What is this shop? What the heck are you? Huh? Hey, Vivalon! So the Vivalon I got is in this area? Sheesh. Because Vivalon comes in so many types of patterns. You're not about to. What is this? Please don't tell me I have to fight all these guys. Just to get to the gym leader. Fight them, please. For my sake. Alrighty then. Let's get on going. That's the gym logo? Wow, at least they updated. No ball guy? Alrighty then. Oh, hey! Came to see this gym, huh? That can only mean one thing. You're not er, out to earn some gym badges and take on the Pokemon League, aren't you? Yes. Yes, I knew it. I'm so glad I asked you to do it. Before you can battle a gym leader, you are going to pass a certain challenge set by them. Their gym tests. Every gym test is different. If you ask the lobby staff about it, they'll tell you what's up. Here, have these. When you use them, consider me healing up your Pokemon. Three Super Potion, great. Oh, I'm so glad you're aiming to be a champion too, so this is the best news ever. Man, I'm so excited. I can barely stand still. 
I guess I'll go battle every trainer I run into. Well, she ain't battling us. Why are we gonna get some new drip? We got a lot of money for now. Oh, great. Welcome to the Cotondo Dream. I don't know what voice I'm going for, but whatever. Let me register as a challenger. Yes. Great. Now, in order to face the gym leader, Katie, you will first need to pass the gym test. Here at the Cotondo Gym, the me that means taking on the olive roll. The what? Olive production is a big part, big part of life at Cotondo. We've held the Olive Harvest Festival each year for generations to usher in bumper crops. To pass our gym test, you'll need to roll an olive-shaped ball on the way to the goal. Your efforts should help ensure we get a great olive harvest next year, too. The staffer over at the olive rolling field will explain the rules to you in further detail. I'll register the location in the map app. It's just north of town. Now get out there and have fun. Manual labor. This is manual labor. So he says north from here? Oh wow, north. Blah bay bay. Blah bay bay. So the moment we exit out, this is Carton though, and this, yeah, as I said before, so this is still South Providence area too, so that still counts as a counter that we were already here before. What the heck is that? Is that an olive? Welcome to the olive rolling field. The, this gym test is all about stamina. You'll need to push with all you've got to, to a large olive, ball rolling and make it to the way to the end. Get the ball over various obstacles and push it to the goal to clear the course. Now that you're all filled in, are you ready? Sure. Great. Put in a wish for the good olive harvest. Roll, roll, roll away. Which is the goal? Does it matter? Oh, wow. Is there a time limit? If it is, I'm kind of screwed. Three, two, one, go. Push it down. Oh my god, these frame rate sucks. Okay. Oh, I see. Can I please get it over there? Please? It's either, if we actually go to that, we battle that trainer, right? Or we take the shortcut. What does an olive have to do with a bug gym? I swear. Even if it's a harvest, what can the bugs do? So we have to avoid that guy, right? So, we go through here. Imagine this thing just bounce off. Hey, yo, get back over there. As I thought. Bring it over here. Go. Get over here, please. All right, brought it in with no hassle. Yay! Check. You passed! Let's go! What's the next thing? With that performance, I'm sure we can look forward to a great olive harvest next year. I'm happy to declare your gym test officially clear. Congrats. Please report your results to the lobby staff at the gym. So those two were just basically... So those two are... So those two are really... Are really just trainers just to gain the way for a battle, right? If we were to mess up, well, that was pretty much easy. 
Alrighty then. Can I jump here? Yes, sir. Welcome back. I hear you're on a roll out there. Big congratulations for the, me for successfully clearing the gym test. Now you earn the right to challenge the gym leader. Best of luck. Are you ready to challenge the sugar bug? Katie the sugar bug. Allow me to show you to the battle court. Get to the point. Get to the point. What's with this loading screen? Oh wow, we got an audience. Eat up my cute little Vivalon. Vivalon. Oh, what a lovely trainee you are. Thank you very much for your skillful olive rolling. It was quite impressive. Oh, did I forget to introduce myself? Forgive me. My name is Katie, and I am the owner here at Patricia Soapberry. Oh, that's right. I'm not in my shop. I'm on duty as a gym leader at Contondo Gym right now. Forgive me. Uh -huh. My name is Katie, and I already went through that. My main line of work is crafting sweets as a pastry chef. Little sweets that bring happiness with just one bite. Bug-type Pokemon hiding in foliage. Both are small and yet very powerful. Don't let your guard down unless you would like to find yourself knocked off your feet. Yeah? We'll take you down right now. You are challenged by gym leader Katie. She has sent out Nimble. Nimble. That looks like a steel bug type, not gonna lie. Don't take my bug type Pokemon lightly. You will be in a world of pain if you do. This is level 14. We were struggling with a level 15 or something in the previous episode. Take this. Ember. It lived. Ah, glad we didn't switch typing. Quick attack. Even though we're already the fastest thing on the field. Thank you. Yes, sir. Tarantula? Eh, we'll get Frey Coco with some, something to work out. He needs some air. Let's go. Let's go, Frey Coco. Tarantula. Oh, that one. We did encounter it before, right? This one is like a real small move. 60, 40. Oh. Incinerate! And if you're hiding something, then it goes away. Screw those berries. So I think that's what incinerate does. If it has a berry, it burns it up. Teddy Ursa! Uh, keep, keep. Oh, you're quite good, aren't you? How should I roll things out from here? She's on her last mon and it's her... Is her ace is a Teddy Ursa? I thought you were a bug type gym leader. What the heck? Run the berry. Now my little Pokemon, time to break free... Oh crud, I forgot about this. Their specialty. Oh crud. I forgot. So it uses bug type moves, no? Please tell me where to survive this. Please tell me where to survive this. Fear swipes. No, 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 no. So once it has that, it becomes that. Come on, got it. Or it becomes that typing. It has, it has, it has an extra one, right? So just having fire for fire just doesn't make sense. So if we want to have an extra typing, then. I still don't understand test realized, but we'll figure it out as we progress in this game. So having fire for fire just don't make a difference then. Uh, unless it boosts boost the attack, right? Feast your eyes on my shining bug decoration, though this is not so sweet. 
Eerie Cutter. Ooh, chill. Incinerate. Teddy Ursa is unable to battle. Yes, sir. Oh, my sweet little Pokemon drop like flies. I thought you were a bug gym leader. Let's go! Wait, Coco is evolving. Hey, sombrero. A crocala. Crocala. Croca. Crocala state has been added to the Pokedex. Your strength rose during our battle like a nice bread in the oven. I feel that I may need to work on my own strength as well. Congratulations, you've passed. As proof of your victory against me, the gym leader, allow me to present you with this gym badge. I hope you'll enjoy alongside a heaping serving of some of my deluxe handmade treats. The gym is on the bottom right? That's crazy. We got the Cortondo badge. With one gym badge in your possession, Pokemon up to level 25 will be easier to catch and will listen to your commands as well. Okay, good. I see you have quite the appetite as well. How about a little TM as a frosting to the cake? Pounce. The heck? The user attacks by pouncing on the target. This also lowers the target speed stat. Once you found a TM during your travels, you can use the, um, use the TM machine to make copies of that TM. You didn't know that, right? I wish you luck in your future adventures. May they be as sweet and lovely as good dessert. Off you go then, until we meet again. Oh. If we added more time, yeah, to the freaking trainer battles, but we just flipped it like that. We know about the level grind. Hey, hey! Just had to tell you, my Pokemon are learning some pretty cool moves, right? Ready! How to go to the gym, by the way? I pass! Yes! Haha! <laughs> I mean, it was obvious you were gonna pass, but congrats! I'm so glad I encouraged you to take on the gyms. Nice job, pass me! I'm training hard too, by the way, day and night, going all over the place to boot. Thank goodness we've got the map app. It helps a ton with figuring out where to go next. Especially in a huge place like Padea. After all, the path to getting stronger usually has some strange stops and detours. Speaking of going strange place, I wonder what Arvin's up to. Anyway, catch you later. I hope you hope you know I'm gonna wait one up battle if we run into each other. She basically hints that we need we should go check up on him at that point. But if we don't have to, then we can just follow the story that we want. Oh man, it's raining. Can you chill with this rain? Oh my gosh. So we got the badge over here. Where to now? That's a bad guy lair I've seen. Where are we at? What are these icons mean? I don't think it's something I have to do yet. We're right. We're right here, right? Paldea is real big. What's over here? So if we're right here, if I'm reading this map, what is this? Psychic type? We might as well, like, scan around the South Providence area, if anything. Star Force Street, Giacomo, the boss of Team Dark Sky. What?
If we go here... This basically says we're in West Providence area. What did it say? Alrighty then. Get out of this rain. Oh sure, we can't swim a freaking big ol' ocean, but we can go through that. It's crazy. Oh, now you can ride it? That's crazy. Can I please leave this place? So the moment I... I just want to check the area on this, at least, if we're either good level or not. If I could find a trainer over there... What are we battling? Fletching! How much damage are we at? Well, we're good. It's level 7. Just keep on riding. Just keep on riding. So this is a brand new area. Skeeto? What level are you? Ooh, level 15. Hold up. We can get it on the first try. And by first try, I mean a great ball. One. Oh, come on, son. Show him my defense. Libero, please. One. Two. I'm just trying to lower the damage. Let's try it again. Great ball, go. Two, three, let's go. Might as well get, might as well. Uh, what was the name? Wonderlock. I don't know why I capitalized. I always go lowercase. I just want that item over there, that's it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're getting ready for our battle. Let's see what we get. We only have- how many punches did I get? See, Pocket Porto. No. Let's see what we get. I need variety, please. I need some type of variety. Tunessa9? What the heck? Why a username? Huh? Yo! Dude, we just keep getting fire type starters. WWW Pokemon GG. Yo, if it's level 100, I'd be damned, but still. What do we got? This is level 1. 
Yo, look at this move set. This crazy. I don't know what WW Pokemon GG is, but I should probably just look it up. But still, we got three starters. We got three stars in this thing. That's just crazy. I think there is a a TCG. Eh, we should be fine. A TCG version of a shiny Fennekin. Well, we got no type coverage. I can swear to you. We got a libero Rabu can't make a change to any type from fire, fighting, flying, whatever. And then we have a fletching that's right in front of us. This is level 14. It's still living. Let's just keep going. I knew it was B1. The burn will take over. Watch. Level 8? Oh my gosh. No, the whatever move says it came with, it was good. Yurei the student. Alright, let's keep on going. What the heck am I seeing? I see a rock rough. Let me find a Pokemon Center at least. Central? This is Providence 1. Central? Is it just Pokemon Centers? I think it's just Pokemon Centers. Alrighty then. What does a shiny Skittle look like? The Fampy is a little... Hey, Mudbray. Can I climb up? Climb up! You can't climb up, that's crazy. Manky fur? Alright, Hyper Potion already? Dude, we could just find anything here. Alrighty then, if we're here and I'm looking for the bad guy, the bad guy is all the way over there. Oh wait, he's over here? Never mind. That says water, but we don't have water coverage, so we will come back to that later. The dark one, I think we can take this on because... Just because how... Just how because... What was I talking about? The dark one because we have Raboon and he has two fighting moves which includes high jump kick. Alrighty then. With that, we'll end the episode right here. Off screen time, I'll probably just head closer and closer whatever the heck I'm at. What the heck? The way I look at it, there's a town up ahead. Because when you look at this map... This is a town, but this is like pure nature. That's a town. That's a base. Alrighty then. Alright, like, comment, subscribe, Shuck is XTB, and I'm sending out.